Hey guys, so we just finished the and, and uh, there's a there's a card game. Yeah, this is and this a, is good for the whole family. So it's not just uh, couples. You can get to know that that brother that you have an awkward relationship with. Andrew, oh boy, <laughs> are you gonna take it home and play with your family? Oh, I wasn't talking about my family. He should. Do your best impression of me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk to me. Don't look at me. <laughs> That's really all it is. <laughs> no, that is not what I do. It really is. You always have, like, if we're not around each other, you have that mean mug face. Like, what are you looking at? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I have to do one of you. Okay. This, this is you. This is you, right? Mm -hmm. Walk in the hallway. There goes your friend. You were so bro. <laughs> um... In what ways did my diagnosis affect our relationship? Honestly, I feel like your diagnosis just made us like, it made us go from like, when we were friends, we were like this. After we got to know each other, we were like this. And I felt like your diagnosis made us like, boom. <laughs> like it's just like, boom, like, yeah. you know? I feel like that's really all it did. Yeah, I agree. It brought yeah. us closer, basically. Yeah. The moment I realized I can trust you, was when I told you I was sick and I told you and you're like okay and you didn't ask no questions you was just whatever I told you is what you took and then that was that why that moment because that's like I don't talk about that I don't okay. tell anybody that so it's like for me to just tell you and like to be like yeah this happened and whatever and you not ask me questions about it and not go so in depth that's like you know. Okay. Why did you share your diagnosis with me and no one else? Like, why did, like, when you shared it, why did you choose me? Because you're my best friend. And, like, you know, I don't want to tell nobody else because it's not their business. <laughs> but when did I become your best friend? You became my best friend, like, two or three years ago. Not freshman year. Yeah. I don't like you and you don't like me. Yeah, so <laughs> the following year, like when we started talking to each other okay. and like, what was it, like global or something? Yeah. 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 And you sat next to me. Okay. Yeah. Um, what do you love about our relationship? It's raw. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, it's like, it's naked. <laughs> 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 like there's no secrets there's like you know like if you ask me something I'll just tell it to you you know like yeah and know? completely unfiltered yeah like completely unfiltered. I'll tell you the truth I'll tell you yeah. specifically what happened yeah you know like there's no secrets no hiding this no hiding that yeah yeah and then there's like the genuine feeling that yeah. we have for each other like we care the same amount, like everything's mutual, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like it's not like this person does it more than that person. Mm -hmm. Everything's mutual, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, what do you think was the hardest thing for me after I found out about your sickness? Maybe, I think, Maybe like you accepting it that like, you know, that it's like, oh, this happened to her, not like her cousin, yeah. you know, like this happened it was strictly like, to why her. her? Yeah. yeah. So I think for you is like accepting it was like a big thing. I feel like I have a hard time accepting things that like I disagree with. Yeah. And you accept things that you don't like. You know, like, if, if that's what it is, okay, it is what it is. Yeah. Accept it and move on. That's you. That's not me, though. Like, if yeah. that's what it is and I don't want that to be what it is, <laughs> like, I'm going to put up a fight. Yeah. yeah. But it's like, there's nothing you can do about it. Because like, even if I know there's nothing I can do about it, though. Yeah. Like, I try to, f like, put up a fight. Yeah. I think that's something you have, like, the ability to accept that I wish I had. Yeah. I know what you mean. So, what was the hardest thing about your fight with cancer, and 
Do you think I was aware of it? I'm pretty sure you were aware of it because there were a lot of things that were hard. Yeah, but for me specifically, it would be my hair. Because it's like, you know, I love my hair. And I feel like I use my hair a lot as like a security blanket. So when I feel like I look ugly or whatever, at least my hair looks good. Yeah. So you were well aware of my hair. <laughs> yeah. What are you hesitant to tell me? Mm, I pretty much know everything, so it's like something I'm hesitant to tell you. Yeah. I think you know everything. You know my past. You know, like the future holds, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. You really want to know something I have to tell you? <laughs> <laughs> I do want to. I have to like build up the momentum. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I'm like in love with you. <laughs> <laughs> Stop lying. I'm, I'm not playing with you. <laughs> I'm not. I'm like serious. I'm like in love with you. I'm not like in love with you. I am. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> What's that reaction? <laughs> like, I am too. And I'm scared to tell you. Okay. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's my turn, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, what's something you never want me to forget? Something I never want you to forget. You don't want me to forget. Hmm. <laughs> I never want you to forget about how much I care about you. And sometimes I just want to shove my foot in your face <laughs> because you don't listen. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. You want to shove your foot in my face? Yeah. Because I don't listen. Yeah. Because, like, I care about you. Okay. And it's like when I tell you stuff for your own good. Like and what? I'm like... <laughs> and I'm like, and I'm like, you know, maybe you shouldn't hang around this specific group of people, you know, because they do this and that's not good okay. for you. And you're like, well, you know, I'm just having fun. So that's why I need to shove my foot sometimes in your face. Okay. You know? So those people yeah. you tell me to stay away from, mm -hmm. I know specifically who you're talking about. Yeah. But they're like childhood friends like we went through everything together like we grew up together they're like siblings yeah and they're older than you which means <laughs> there you go because you know where i'm going with this <laughs> i don't yeah that even though they're older than you doesn't mean that they should be acting younger than you exactly if you say so you know what i'm talking about okay yeah <laughs> I'm trying to remember your question to see if maybe um, I want to what ask. Uh, what's something you never want to forget about? So what's something that you don't want me to forget about you? <laughs> I think it would be the same thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because I really love and care for you. Like, I'm not even talking about being in love. Like, as a person. Yeah. I just genuinely love you as a person. And I care for you as a person. Like, I don't know what it was that did it, but like ever since we like got back in contact and we've been like that, mm -hmm. you know, it was just like everything just like skyrocketed from there. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. What are the next steps in our relationship? Mm. So, the next steps in our relationship, I think we definitely have some stuff to talk about. <laughs> um, but I think I think we have some stuff to talk about but I think the next steps for our relationship we can't we can't decide that everything's gonna stay natural yeah like nothing's gonna be forced yeah of course whatever happens happens yeah. and that's that but you know I don't feel like anything wrong is gonna happen yeah. and if it does then that's we'll just fine like, yeah Cause that's life, 
everything's mm. not gonna be, be perfect yeah because i'll be here for support mm. you'll be there for support yeah so we'll be fine we're unstoppable <laughs> Stoppable. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey guys, I'm really hoping you enjoyed that. Listen, if you'd like to see more from the Skin Deep, support us at our Patreon here. If you want to keep watching, we got a link right there. <laughs>